Hi everyone and welcome back to my kitchen. I'm back today with another cheesecake creation and this one is going to be perfect for the holiday season. I've been making my Irish cream mint chocolate cheesecake. Now all those flavors combine together to create the most phenomenal dessert. I'm going to start out with my chocolate cake layer as the base for the cheesecake. Then we're going to make an Irish cream and mint cheesecake dotted with chopped Andes candies and loads of Bailey's Irish cream. I'm gonna finish the cake off with some mint whipped cream and my chocolate mint macaroons. This cake is simply stunning. For my chocolate cake layer, I use my basic chocolate cake recipe. I baked half a recipe in an eight inch springform pan. Just let it cool off completely, level off the top. I'm gonna measure out some Irish cream into a bowl here and I really wanna soak that cake layer so it remains nice and moist when it's in baking in the oven. Just take a pastry brush and brush that on there. and then assemble that spring form. And now we could start on that cheesecake layer filling. I'm going to start my cheesecake layer by placing two eight ounce bricks of softened cream cheese into my mixer bowl. So I'm just gonna whisk the cream cheese for about five to six minutes until it's really nice and fluffy. And don't forget to scrape down the sides of the bowl so you get all that cream cheese softened. Next, I'm going to add in two large eggs, half a cup of white granulated sugar, and half a cup of Irish cream and then mix that all together for about three to four minutes until it's well mixed. And then for that peppermint flavor, I'm going to add a quarter teaspoon of peppermint oil and a few drops of green food coloring. And last, I'm going to add in about half a cup of chopped Andes chocolate mint candies and then use my spatula to gently fold those in. And pour the cheesecake batter over the chocolate cake, level off the top with a little spatula, and then this goes into the oven at 325 degrees Fahrenheit for about an hour, hour 15 minutes. You wanna bake until that top is completely set, and once it's done, just take it out and let it cool completely on a wire rack. And once your cheesecake is done baking, allow it to cool at room temperature for about 30 minutes and then place it into the fridge and let it cool completely. It just takes a few hours. I just transferred it out of the springform pan onto a cake stand. And now it's time to make that mint whipped cream frosting. I'm going to pour in two cups of chilled heavy cream into my mixer and add about one cup of confectioner sugar. And then whisk the two together on high speed for about three to four minutes until I get stiff and fluffy peaks. In a separate mixing bowl, I've softened eight ounces of cream cheese. I'm just going to use my hand mixer to blend that for about a minute until it's smooth. And then pour in half a cup of Irish cream. And add a few drops of peppermint oil. Mix that again until that mixture is nice and smooth and then add that cream cheese mixture to the whipped cream. And give this a mix for about a minute until you get a stiff and fluffy frosting. First, I'm going to spread a nice generous amount over the top. And I'm going to add a little bit of melted chocolate to the top. Transfer the remaining cream into a pastry bag, and today I'm using a Teco tip number 847, and then pipe generous dollops on top. And I'm going to garnish the cake with my chocolate mint macaroons. some fun little sprinkles. And now let's cut into this epic cheesecake so you guys can see what it looks like on the inside. Just grab a sharp knife. Oh, and check that out, isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely love that chocolate cake layer with that cheesecake and then that whipped cream on top. This is going to be so good. And you know I always like to add an extra dollop of whipped cream on the side. 
Now imagine serving this cheesecake at your next holiday get together. This will be gone in minutes, I guarantee you. Now for the recipes for the chocolate mint macaroons that I added on top and that chocolate cake layer, just head down into my video description box and I've linked up those YouTube videos as well. Time to dig in and enjoy this and this looks so good. Mmm. Wow, wow, wow. This is so incredibly delicious, guys. I love that light mint flavor that you get throughout the cake, and you also get that light Irish cream flavor. And that whipped cream, let me tell you, it is so good. It's light and fluffy, and it adds that nice airy element to this cheesecake. And then you get that creamy mint layer. Love that it's dotted with little bits of those Andes chocolate pieces. And then that fudgy chocolate cake base is just so good. All this combined together, Plus those macaroons on top, let's not forget about those. Makes for an absolutely show-stopping cake. If you're looking for the epic cheesecake recipe to serve at your next holiday get-together, this one is it. Just head down into my video description box, you'll find a link that'll take you over to my blog where you can print this recipe off, save it to Pinterest, and of course share it with all your family and friends. Hope you enjoy this cake this holiday season, and I'll see you next time.